An extract from the Twits by Roald Dahl. How are you going to do that? asked Mrs. Twit, who had come outside to see what all the noise was about. I won't have you smearing sticky glue on all over the roof of our house. Mr. Twit got very excited. I've got a great idea, he cried. He didn't bother to keep his voice down because he didn't think the monkeys could understand. We'll both go into town right away and we'll buy a gun each, he shouted. How's that? Brilliant! cried Mrs. Twit, grinning and showing her long yellow teeth. We'll buy those big shotguns that spray out 50 bullets or more with each bang. Exactly, said Mr. Twit. Lock up the house while I go and make sure the monkeys are safely shut away. Mr. Twit went over the monkey cage. Attention! He barked in the fearsome monkey trainer's voice. Upside down, all of you, and jump to it. One on top of the other. Quick, get on with it, or you'll feel Mr. Twit stick across your backsides. Obediently, the poor monkeys stood on their hands and clambered one on top of the other, with Mother Lump at the bottom and the smallest child at the very top. Now stay there till we come back. Mr. Twit ordered. Don't you dare move and don't overbalance. When we return in two or three hours time, I shall expect to find you all in exactly the same position as you are now. You understand? With that, Mr. Twit marched away. Mrs. Twit went with it and the monkeys were left alone with the birds.